we're going to show you our top 10 male sex toys that are discreet. Many sex toys for men look like real vaginas, breasts, and buttholes, and are not very discreet. These sex toys are made to not look like sexy toys or real body parts. Some are so disguised you could actually leave them out and no one would ever know what they really are. The Road Warrior Whacker. When you just gotta whack the willy. So it's got some bumpy texture on the inside. Wait a second, did you read the instructions before you opened it up? <laughs> Quite the process. Simple, cheap, effective. How do you know? I suppose that? anything is effective if you put it on your dick and you jerk off with it and then you ejaculate. Course. Jackets stroker pad. That's right. It's not a sleeve, it's a pad. Soft and squidgy. Hey, Ian, put on your jacket. <laughs> okay. Uh. It's a pad that you put in the palm of your hand and it's got some ridges in it and you curl it around your ding dong and you stroke yourself off like that. Very simple, but if you saw this lying around on a table, would you think that that was a sex toy? That is a pretty discreet sex toy. Yes. They probably will not come anywhere near it because they think it's a female maxi pad. Although I know some perverts that would probably be like, hey, that looks like a... <laughs> oh. Soft and squidgy. The Colt Power Stroker. It looks like a grenade. That is pretty cool. You got a little butthole imprint on the bottom. It's not real obvious. I think anybody that sees that is like, oh, hey, that's a cool rubber grenade. Boink, boink, keep your eye. Now it's full of cat hair. The inside is textured like ribs, and it feels pretty cool. Got a hole on the other side, so you can just rinse it out when you go to clean it. Teenager could probably have this in his room, and it their parents would not look at that like you stick your dick into it. Just looks like a little boy toy. Also great for a goo grenade. Next one. Hello. The Optimum Power Master Wand Vibrating Stroker by Cal... How do you pronounce that? Cal Exotics. Cal Exotics. Sounds like you're saying Cal Exotics, which is a different company. It does not look like a sex toy. I think this is equivalent to what a vibrator is for a female. I consider this to be a uh, masturbation supplement. It's not, you're not gonna get the full puss or bum hole experience with this thing, but it wraps around a section of the dick and vibrates while there's still more dick left over you can have fun with. Cock, cock. Give me, give me, give me fried chicken. It's also a great toy for your partner to tease you with before you get down to bone it. That blue dildo could be your dildo. I mean penis. So in other words, you could probably vibrate it here. Ah, oh, blah, 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 and you're still stroking it like this. Blah, blah, blah. You're in the light. What? You're in the light. Oh, Jesus. Well, yeah, put the gray toy on the gray pants. That'll be a good way to show it off. Let's get some power, man. Different settings. Yeah, too, we can have races. The next toy is called Mistress, the perfect f double trouble series BFFs. Now this is two girls on top of each other and you get their, their hole and their and then the other one's and so four f holes for you and three of your f buddies to f and get all over. See who first and shoots out the other end here. The holes all go through. And the best part about it is it's super discreet. SpongeBob. Dr. Love's Supper Stroker Sleeve. It looks like supper, but it's slipper. I know, I know. I was just joking, I'm not that dumb. But I suppose it could be supper for somebody who likes semen. And it's definitely got a ribbed tunnel. It also says realistic feel. Yeah, yeah, that's what I was gonna goof yeah. on. It sure feels realistic to me. It feels like a real thing. It's, it's very know. slick. It's <laughs> Nobody would know what this was. It could be a bicycle hand grip. Plunger grip. Yep. Yeah, any size penis is gonna fit in that. Chinese finger trap. Chinese dick trap. Like, who's gonna fall out first? That was a great sound. Is your dick three and a half feet long? Then this will work for you. And you know what? It didn't rip. 
didn't tear. It's good. Super Got the love supper super stroker. It's so discreet and so does not look like a sex toy that we had to include it in this list. And that is the Tenga Geo. And what you do is you flip these things inside out and you stroke. This is like the only sex toy that has some like artistic value. Like the actual inside that strokes your penis is supposed to be the outside that somebody looks at and says, ooh, what is that? They don't know that it's the inside of the sex toy that you stroke up and down on your ding dong skin. Stick it in my mouth. Looks like cauliflower, doesn't it? And it comes on its little stand. So you can put this on your desk and it looks like a little piece of art on your desk. No one would have any idea that you stick your dick in and then you go Ooh. with it. And it's Tenga. They make really high quality products. Tenga's awesome. Hey, okay, so Randy, how are those reports doing today? Okay, you take it easy now. Oh, what's on my hand? Ugh, it's your jizz, but he'll never know. Right. Just so you know, you can buy most of these toys on the list at the Loyal Toys website. Something we want to tell you is that we aren't pitching this stuff to sell you the toys, but we are selling these toys because we look for the best stuff to sell. Make sense? That's the whole point of Loyal Toys, to weed out the shitty sex toys and sell only the best ones we test and approve. Here's the Kiru Kion. It's rechargeable, you can take it anywhere. Before, we used to think that you needed straight AC power to be plugged into a device to have it work well without it freaking dying on you. But this changed our mind. So it's got all this nice little nubbly texture on the inside. Looks sort of like a uh, Keurig coffee maker. Look, it's one of those blood pressure machines from CVS or Walmart. <laughs> it's the best automatic VJ machine that you can get but it is a little bit pricey. It's about 250 bucks. If you can afford that kind of money for a sex toy, this is the one to get. And as you shorten it, the stroke gets faster. Until you're at this. And that is a 260 strokes per minute. Let's count them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. 15,800. That's a full hour. That could be your dick in there. Couldn't you go out in public and just stand around like this? It's covering your dick and you're out at the mall standing on the street could you get arrested you're like oh my dick might not even be in it how do you know and you can keep this on your desk and no one will question what it is or maybe Continue. they will because it looks so cool wow that's cool what does that do sucks my dick another great automatic bj machine is the, the leeton future nerf gun pro does that look like a sex toy to you? It looks like a kid's uh, toy, which could be dangerous if you have small kids around and they find this. It's yeah. going, they're going to want to play with it. Shoot and goo at everybody. Goo, goo, goo. This high-tech futuristic man meat milker is the best blowjob sex toy for your money. Apply lubrication, stick your penis in, and let it massage your manhood until you orgasm, giving you a mechanical blowjob. Because it's not battery powered and plugs directly into the wall, this thing is powerful. It's, that's as fast as it can go. Press it again and it's a different mode. Again. And a pause button. It has an electric air bladder that actually tightens the inside hole. Hey, this button activates some sexy Asian voices. It sounds like somebody's beating the shit out of a baby. And if you don't want anybody to hear the voices, you have the headphone jack right here. And for the dryer, when you turn that button on, it activates the fan in this cap. The hot air goes out of here and dries off the inside of the uh, sleeve. This thing will blow your socks off. It will blow your penis on. It's under 200 bucks with the discount. And that's a great deal for the money. Watch this video on Miggy Wave Cup. Lam how it will be found for you and you will enjoy. It is the top selling sex toy on the website and it does not look like something that you would jerk off with. Stick your ding dong in there and then you squeeze and you put pressure on your dick. And it feels good. It's very easy to clean and it feels great. Especially when it's brand new like that. It's yeah. so shiny. It's just calling out saying, yeah. put me in here and stroke me up and down your penis. With the covers on it. I don't know what that looks like. Very discreet. No, not like vagina. No need to hide. Could be cat for your drink. <laughs> Could be instrument for music. <laughs>
could be case for items. <laughs> Unlike most pocket pussies, the hole goes all the way through so you can fuck it both ways. One side is supposed to look like a slightly like a vagina and you could think it's a mouth. Any length dick is still good. And if you wanted it tighter, you squeeze these and it gets tighter. And it gets tighter. Or if you're Ian and you squeeze tighter. Even if your dick was this small, I feel it tightening against it and it would work good. Me right! You can also shoot through it at stuff if you want. But you know what, if I do this, and I fart in it, let it unsqueeze, and now I, ah, oh, you could use it for that, a fart holder. The Miggy Wave Cup. Found for whole family, if whole family have dick. Now for the most discreet looking, it looks like something else, and that is freaking cool. We have the Sir Richard's Control. This is a male stroker that looks like a shampoo or conditioner bottle. It's actually disguising itself as something else, where everything else that we've shown may or may not look like something. But you pull the cap off, and even that's sort of discreet in that it doesn't look like a vagina or anything. It just looks like a donut hole. If you were somebody's mom and didn't expect to see that when they and they happened to unscrew the bottom of a shampoo bottle, she would probably be like, what is this? And it has a little pocket that you can stick a bullet vibrator in the end. You just slide the bullet vibrator in there and it vibrates the hell out of it. And that feels really good. On your dick. You can jack off with it in the bottle. With the cap open, it's, it's pretty... I don't want to say it's loose, but you can, it's pretty easy and slippery, but when you push it in, it's its almost like it's sucking it back in. It's kind of nice. Or you can pull it out, you can just jack off with the sleeve. So as you tighten your grip, it tightens up on your dick. You can also jack off with this duck. Because it has a vagina. All right, get that out of here. You can even squeeze the bottle a bit to put some pressure on too. And that will tighten up. So your dick size, you could probably have an even smaller dick, even like Ian. You could bring it anywhere. You could stick it in a gym bag. You could keep it in the shower, in your own shower. Nobody's gonna think anything of it unless they try to use it. Just don't forget to clean it out when you're done. The, the one non-discreet thing about this bottle, which makes it kind of ironic. It looks like it's saying shampoo related things, but it's not shampoo related things. It makes it kind of funny and clever. Come on, come on. Nope, we're gonna go ahead and... Ah. That's wonderful. You know how you like your smell of your own farts. Oh, I your... think a little wet in my mouth. <laughs> your breath ruined my fart. And also, if you like this video, subscribe to the channel, obviously. But also, check out the Loyal Toys YouTube channel. We have videos on there. We also have our buddy Brian doing a lot of videos on sex toys. Very funny. <laughs> Everything is entertaining and fun to watch. And he's funny. Check him out right here. And he's funny. Hey, you guys still have that sale on chicken breasts? Get one. Oh, look at that. Ah. 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 There we go. Bye.